What's up everyone, it's Mike here for you, and tonight I've got some pure tobacco fresh mint. Alright folks, pure tobacco fresh mint available at 5starhookah.com. A huge thanks to everyone over there for making this review possible. But Pure Tobacco, a relatively new brand out on the market, and Fresh Mint happens to be one of their top flavors. So, of course, I got to try it out, me being a mint fan myself. So, let's go ahead and get on with it. The smell, you open it up and you get a very strong aroma of mint. Definitely a straightforward mint just like the the name would imply fresh mint it does have a little bit of a sweetness to it not a peppermint sweetness but just a little touch of sweetness to go along with that mint and I am definitely getting a little bit of a menthol cooling effect with it as well as far as the cut it's your typical modern tobacco stuff medium to large choppy leaf a little bit of stems rather juicy and a nice undyed golden brown color to it. So I've been going quite a while now actually. I'm on my second bowl, went back to back, which is very rare for me, but I really do enjoy it. So I'm about 45 minutes into my second bowl using my caravan rig, water in the base, my dedicated mint KM hose here, Goodfellow Bowl, single layer of HD foil, and three Medwalk coals. So let's see what we have. As you see, nice clouds. Pretty standard for all of your modern tobacco brands. So no complaints. As far as the flavor strength, again, it is strong. It's not over the top strong, and it's not the strongest that I've had in my experience, but definitely a very strong flavor. I'll give this about an 8.5 out of 10 on the flavor strength. Now, as far as the flavor itself, just like I said with the smell, it's definitely a straightforward mint flavor to it. Touch of sweetness, but nothing like you would find in a peppermint and then it does have a very nice menthol cooling effect with it so as far as the flavor goes it's definitely spot on to what it's claiming to be I do really like this flavor I've heard people mention or compare it to Alfacher mint or at least Alfacher mint back in the day before it started to lose its strength but I can see that, but for me personally, I really consider this more along the lines of a Nakla Miso Mint. It's not as strong when it comes to the, you know, the, the strength of the mint itself, but it is very close to it. So as far as that goes, I have my favorites when it comes to peppermints, and I have my favorites when it comes to straightforward mints. Nakla Miso Mint is probably the top of my list as far as straight mints go but this is going to have to be a close second again very good flavor the longevity of it it goes for about an hour and a half before I'd say that it really starts to lose its flavor which is not bad at all so definitely no complaints and I haven't had any issues with it at all as far as heat management goes so I can't complain there either so as far as my rating goes all things considered, like I said, it, it's, it's not over the top strong, but it is definitely strong. You can definitely feel it in your sinuses, in your lungs, in your throat. It has that nice menthol cooling effect to it. So it is very good in that department. Being mint, it's going to be an excellent mixer. You can mix it with a ton of different flavors and get very good results with this. So that's good. As far as my rating goes, I'm going to go ahead and give this a 9 out of a 10. When it comes to mint flavors, I don't generally include this with any 
certain flavor profiles but when it comes to mint I really do look for more of a nicotine buzz to it so that just comes from years of smoking mint and I kind of want to have that nicotine involved when I'm smoking mint so not a huge factor I can definitely mix some celestial in with this and, and have probably the, the perfect session the most perfect that I can ask for so very good but because of the flavor strength that'll knock it down a little bit still a very good mint flavor I'm definitely going to keep it in my stash I think it's a staple for any mint fan and I highly recommend it so you can find it at 5 I'll leave a direct link in the description below if you happen to be a member of my group on Facebook hookah enthusiasts check out the pin post it'll give you a nice little discount code to use you can go ahead and pick this up for a little bit cheaper but anyhow folks thanks for watching if you can, please comment, like, and subscribe. And until next time, smoke on.